they were the ones looking to drive the ball. They were looking to step in in threes, and, and they got got themselves going. And so, you know, they, they took the momentum. They had their crowd with them. Um, you know, they started to feel a little confidence for the first time in the three games, and we didn't get enough stops. Brian Lewis with the New York Post. This is a uh, twofold, Steve. Uh, when you guys had tied it up on those KD free throws at 75 all, the game is there for the taking. Are you surprised or disappointed at your guys' defense at that point? I think you hit, let him hit like seven of eight or something like that. And uh, do you think the uh, second question is, do you think the crowd here played any role in uh, Kyrie? It looked like he had a hard time getting started in first half. Uh, I, I don't think the crowd limited Kai. Um, you know, I, yeah, I don't, I don't think so. But, uh, yeah, you know, I don't know about this point. I, I just think we all feel like we could have played better defensively. You know, we, we didn't get stops when it mattered. And, and uh, for large portions of the game, you know, we, we gave up 125 points. So it's, it's just too many uh, big quarters for them. They had, uh, you know, high 20s or, or 30s, all four quarters. Um, you know, not a great performance. Um, but it could be good for us. You know, we, we it's so new for us to face a little adversity, to go through some of these battles and challenges, to pick ourselves up and, and, and look over some things tomorrow and come back uh, on Sunday. Tom Dowd, BrooklynNets.com. Steve, just curious where you saw on the offense, man. Obviously, you know, uh, Harden and uh, Durant scored a ton for you tonight. Um, I'm just curious about the offensive rhythm uh, beyond that. Yeah, you know, I thought for big portions, we got a little stagnant. You know, we, we, we got away from our movement. Um, you know, I thought, you know, James was scoring in isolation. Kevin was scoring in isolation. But, you know, I still think that, um, you know, we can be more difficult to guard in general if we if we move the ball and get to isolations as a second resort. Um, you know, again, like I said, we got to learn from this, take something from it. How can we refine what we're doing and, and add this to uh, our experiences? Christian Winfield, New York Daily News. Hey, Coach, uh, just not having Jeff out there, how, how did that impact the game? And then did that play a factor in how Tristan Thompson was able to dominate the offensive class? And I remember you saying that Jeff's absence would create more time for Nick. What did you think of Nick's performance? And do you think that maybe DeAndre might be up for some minutes since he might be a guy who can help contain Tristan like that? Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know that Jeff uh, is – his strength is is going to be keeping Thompson off the glass, but we certainly miss his versatility, you know, his ability to to play multiple positions, multiple roles. Um, you know, Nick had an up and down night. Um, young player trying to trying to figure it out in a in a big moment, but uh, you know that's that's going to come for Nick. We we believe in him. We want to support him. Um, but you know, anyone can play for us. You know, you look down our bench. We we believe and trust in all these guys. There's probably not enough minutes to to go around, but, uh, you know, we can always push different buttons and play different guys. And, you know, that, that kind of happens from, from uh, you know, judging the flow of the game standpoint. Ian O'Connor, New York Post. Uh, Steve, I think obviously a lot of people felt like uh, entering tonight, you guys were in complete control of this series. And uh, I'm just curious if you're concerned at all that you gave the Celtics a, a reason to believe by, by allowing, allowing them to win this game and, and if so, why? And if not, why not? Uh, no, I mean, we, we de they definitely are going to have belief now. They got to, you know, I uh, got to win at home and we're able to stop the momentum um, after playing two games in Brooklyn. So, you know, big challenge for us. We got to come out and be sharper, be better at both ends of the floor and uh, try to slow them down and, and execute offensively.